I love Zoom. I think it's a gift of the pandemic. And I wish I had the foresight and the money to buy Zoom stock about a year and a half ago. I do all kinds of different meetings on Zoom. I go to 12-step meetings all over the world. I have regular get-togethers with my family. Any kind of storytelling event you can imagine, open mic swap, class, improv. I go to dance parties, meditation, yoga, all kinds of things. But Zoom has its limitations. It's very good for maintaining connection, but it can't replace the in-person, absolutely. Like, let's say you are interested in someone you see on Zoom. You're, you know, you're in a Zoom square and you're just a torso and they're just a torso and you can't sort of, you know, touch an arm or express interest, it's limited. And then there's the breakout room. Ugh. If you're taking a class or doing a work thing or on a committee and you need to break into small groups, I get it. It makes sense. But socializing in a breakout room, like sort of enforced socializing where you're randomly thrust into groups of people you don't know, you may not even care for, it's weird and not my kind of weird.